Hi there. This is Ryan Malloy here at the Worldwide Center of Mathematics. In this video, we're going to discuss how to do beginning division. Let's suppose that you're given a problem like 6 divided by 3. We want to know what the answer is. Well, at some point in your life, you may eventually just start to memorize the answers to questions as simple as these. But at first, it can be a little confusing. So let's talk about some different strategies for how you can figure this out. One is to remember that division is the opposite of multiplication. So you can rewrite this as 3 times something equals 6. And from here, you can guess and check until you get the right answer, which is 2. We can bring that answer back over here. 6 divided by 3 is 2. Alternatively, you can think of 3 as a unit or a set of blocks. So you've got a little set of 3 blocks. How many times would you need to stack this on top of itself in order to get 6? Here's 1. 1, 2, 3. Here's 2, 4, 5, 6. So there. 3 times 2 is 6. Or 6 divided by 3 is 2. And of course, this works with larger numbers as well. Let's suppose that we want to do 20 divided by 4. Let's use our block method again. Here's the first set, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's not enough, so we'll add another one. 5, 6, 7, 8. Still not enough. Let's add another one. 9, 10, 11, 12. Getting closer, still not enough. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Looks like we're just going to need one more. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. So there we have it. Twenty divided by four is five. My name is Ryan Malloy, and we've just discussed how to do beginning division.